I want to derive the distance formula in polar coordinates. Now to do this, I'm going to need to recall the law of cosines. If you have a triangle, it's not necessarily a right triangle, and you know three, uh, two sides and the angle between them, you can find the third side using this formula. c squared equals a squared plus b squared minus 2ab cosine theta. And again, a and b are the two known sides, theta is the angle between them. All right, let's look at our picture here. I've graphed two points in polar coordinates. One is r1 theta1, the other is r2 theta2. I want to find the distance between these points. Now, in order to do this, I need the length of these two sides, and I need this angle. Now, r2 theta2 is r2 away from the origin, so that gives me this length as r2. And r1 theta1 is r1 away from the origin. Theta2 represents the angle that this point makes with the positive x-axis. And theta1 is the angle this one makes with the positive x-axis. So this angle between them is going to be theta2 minus theta1. So I have two sides and the angle between them. And I'm ready to use the law of cosines to derive a distance formula. So the distance formula looks like this. d squared equals r1 squared plus r2 squared minus twice the product r1 and r2. 2r1, r2 times the cosine of the angle between them, which is theta 2 minus theta 1. That's it. That's the distance formula. Now, obviously, you'll take the square root of the result, but it's basically in the form of the law of cosines. And we'll use this um, to find the distance between two points in polar coordinates.